So what we did last time was we restricted the date to a specific range. And what we're going to do this time is we are going to restrict data entry to only items within a list. So this is similar to like a lookup field in Access, okay, where they have to pick from a list, similar in concept, but we're doing this in our Excel table. So the range of cells that we want affected is the rate. So we're going to select K5 through K25, and then we're going to go into data validation Click on data validation again, and then we're going to go over to settings. And where it says allow, we're going to click on this and we're going to choose list. And then where it says source, we are going to key in the values that are acceptable, putting a comma in between them. And the numbers themselves can have decimal places, but you're not going to put in the dollar sign or anything like that. So we got 175 comma, 185 comma, 190 comma, and 200. Those are the acceptable values. So we're going to go ahead and click OK. And now we're going to be adding another new record. So we're going to right click on 26, which is the bottom, and we're going to insert. And we'll go ahead and start keying in our data. All right, that brings us over to rate. And you will notice that there is now a list arrow. And we have to pick a value from the list. And instead of picking a value, they want us to just do 225. Press tab. And so we are getting kind of a little generic error message. And we are going to go ahead and they would like us to click on cancel. And you'll notice when you click on cancel, it does delete the value. And what they would like us to put in there is 200. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and save. 